Good morning, guys, and happy Sabbath. As you can tell, I just woke up. I am going to be talking about today. It's going to be a follow up from my previous video. I'm going to be doing a video vlog on what I eat today, raw vegan. Stay tuned. Good morning, guys. It is my first day eating raw. Yesterday, I did my last and third day full of the water detox, and today it's time for some juice and some veggies and fruits. Last night, I was so tired, I didn't even get to record it, but I honestly had some carrots, broccoli, and my own vegan raw ranch dressing that I may put the description, excuse me, the link in the description below. And today, my friend, which I was going to make like an overnight chia oatmeal, my friend made me like an almond butter with smashed bananas and you put all kinds of nuts and seeds and anything you want in it. Let me show you what it looks like. It is amazing. And here it is. So it's kind of like an oatmeal, but it's raw and totally good for you. A lot of people think that eating raw is really yucky and boring and all you eat is salads, but there are so many things that you can eat. And I said in my last video, you can definitely go ahead and follow on YouTube this girl called Fully Raw Christina. She is amazing. She's been doing it for 15 years and she is so super healthy. She is a blessing to my life when I'm doing my detox because I'm not overwhelmed by just eating salads every day. So uh, stay tuned so you can see what I'm gonna eat for lunch. All right, guys, it is lunchtime and I'm really excited. I am dying to eat my salad. Um, it's going to be a little bit of chaos in there. My cousin decided to make spaghetti today with a homemade pasta sauce, spaghetti sauce, but I'm not going to eat that because I have my delicious salad waiting for me. So what's going to be in the salad is going to be lettuce, tomatoes, corn, garbanzos, which I love. I made, uh, my dressing is just a little bit of oil, vinegar, and some Himalayan salt. I also have some nutritional yeast. Some of those who don't know what it is, I didn't know what it was until years before. It's amazing. It's like a vegan form of cheddar cheese and it comes in flakes. You can put it on your popcorn, you can put it on your salad, you can put it on everything. And then I also have craisins, I have almonds, and I also have some sunflower seeds and pumpkin seeds. So bon appetit. So I am done with lunch and it was so good. If you would have told me about fifth, not fifth, five years ago that I was gonna get full with a salad, I'd be like, you're crazy because I did not like any vegetables. I ate some fruits, but I just, I didn't like vegetables at all. And I see people like munching on the salad and it was like so delicious and they're like, oh my gosh. And I do, I was like, you're crazy. Now. It was amazing. It was so amazing. I had such a big salad and I'm totally full. Now I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna have for dessert. It's gonna be something very, very simple. I made, um, I don't eat chocolate anyways. So I made like a carob syrup sauce sort of thing to dip my strawberries and banana in. And it's just honey, peanut butter powder. You can use peanut butter or almond butter unsalted or unsweetened, however you wanna say it. Um, agave or maple syrup or honey and some coconut oil that you would warm up if it's in solid state you would warm it up in the microwave so that it can go ahead and kind of give it that silky consistency and I'm just gonna dip some strawberries you can dip any type of fruit that you want in there and it is amazing it tastes like dark chocolate to me honestly so that is gonna be my lunch and my dessert for today
it's time to eat. So what you guys saw, um, the sauces that you guys saw was a ranch dressing that I made yesterday and it has a cashew base. And then I also, my friend um, made me, in Spanish it's called, the sauce is called mezcla, which is usually like red peppers and a whole bunch of other stuff. It's kind of like a red peppery, not spicy, but savory, salty, onion and garlic that's this one right here um that sauce so i hope i remember to put the link to both those in the description box below and i am ready to eat i hope that you guys um enjoyed my day let me know if this may motivate you guys to go ahead and try fully raw for one day there's a million and one recipes that you guys can do and um it really wasn't bad i honestly had no cravings at all today so I'm gonna go ahead and enjoy that with my coconut water. And then probably for dessert, I'm going to have my juice that I made yesterday, which I hope I can also remember to put the description in the box, excuse me, put the link in the box below. And that is it for today. So I hope that you guys have a good day, a good week, stay healthy, and till next time.